hi everyone welcome back guys uh, today is we are going to discuss how to execute javascript okay we are going to set up a softwares not only the javascript if you want to run any ui technologies okay you need couple of softwares in your local system what are the softwares required how many ways i can execute javascript okay we have so many ways we can execute the javascript guys first we'll go for the environmental setup okay now have a look here guys what are the softwares need to be installed okay now i mean to say installation softwares okay mainly we need two softwares guys installation softwares for ui now you are learning angular you are running react you are learning html css okay for all the technologies the common softwares we have there are main two softwares is required one for the ide is nothing but integrated development environment you need to install the visual studio code guys visual studio code another software we need call now number two we need a node.js okay node.js is kind of a server okay as of now you can ignore but as part of the installation we need to complete installation setup for visual studio code and as well as node.js here then okay how many ways we can execute guys we can execute javascript programs javascript programs in two ways okay first approach using the browser and the second approach using the node js okay as part of throughout my sessions i will be use mostly using the node js it will be a development will be more easier compared to the browser here but anyway i will explain you how to execute javascript programs using the browser and as well as using the node js here okay now before going to start okay let me show you how to download visual studio code and how to download node js okay now go to the browser here just type visual studio code okay it is a popular ide guys now for the ui development we will be use this software see this is the official website click here now it will just we have a code editing one of the editor now the ui will be look like in this structure guys click download for windows okay now thanks for downloading visual studio is downloaded this is one software and you need to download another software called node js now visit node.js website and see click on the windows installer it will be download the node.js softwares here okay it's kind of a dot exe files you can install by yourself okay still if you need the video okay how to install each and every step just visit our website guys uh, www.youtube.com slash java express just you can type java express now here in the java uh, java express channel already we are pre recorded videos are available click on the playlist okay anyway i will be share you the links in the description okay how to install visual studio code see there is option called software installation click on full view playlist here we have an option called see here how to install node js on windows 10 how to install visual studio code on windows 10 okay if you watch these two videos you can able to okay install these two softwares in your local system now here the setup is completed here this is the copy anyway i will be share you the links uh, as part of the description guys and as well as my previous session also i will be keep it in the description guys guys please if you are really like our sessions please like and leave your comments guys okay now these are the two uh, links you need to complete this is the first one now second now what we can do we can execute javascript in two ways by using the browser and using the node.js now let me show you open the google chrome here okay now anywhere just open your google chrome so wherever you want just open that google chrome right click see guys right click on the browser 
right click and there is an option called inspect here click inspect here now here if you some people used to get in the right hand side some people used to get in the left hand side here we have an option called settings oh no let me share you see here if you click on three dots here we have multiple options we have choose here third option so it will be go to the bottom it will be easier for you here you may see so many options we have elements console sources click on the console here okay now see how to execute a javascript program see simple i want to add two numbers see here guys 45 plus 87 see you get output this is a javascript program i want to print some log like if you're learning java uh, java system dot out dot print ln if you know linux or python echo command right in the javascript we have a command called console dot log log now you want to write something just let me zoom it to you see welcome to javascript just let me write it here now just me paste it here. see welcome to javascript is printed here this is one of the approach we can execute the javascript but in the real time when you are working in any projects okay the browser is not i mean to say not comfortable to write the programs okay this is for for testing how it will be work using the browser why because inside a browser we have one of the javascript engine called v8 in the last session already i explained to you guys okay this is one approach here and we have another approach using the node.js using the node.js how to execute the javascript program before executing the node.js first how to use visual studio code you need to get some idea here so throughout our web series we will be develop javascript programs in one folder so in the desktop just i am creating one folder guys click new folder here choose javascript javascript examples let me create one folder here okay javascript just open here okay once you installed once you install visual studio code okay now in the command prompt in the bottom you are able to see guys here type cmd here cmd it will be open one command prompt for you this is one approach you can do that guys okay now here just type cod code dot then it will be open a visual studio your workspace is loaded into your uh, visual studio code see here the folder is uploaded here this is one approach okay this is one approach here now suppose let me close it here and another way how you can open just in the search bar type visual studio code see it will open a visual studio code now here you need to import you need to import a workspace now by default it is open for you see there is an option called file and there is a open folder if you click on open folder whichever you want to browse you can browse it here click select folder see same program here okay this is about a workspace how to create this visual studio inside this visual studio here we have an option called see if you want to create a new file there is a option called new file we have another file called folder let me create the folder here 01 underscore je okay or js javascript basics let me create one folder for you okay here i want to create one file right click new file here you want to provide some name some kind of a name okay uh, how to execute in node.js i'm explaining right now sorry seek app one dot js the extension will be js guys javascript here okay now here see here what you can do console dot log you can use whatever welcome let me make it welcome to javascript course javascript course after installation about your visual studio code and node.js okay then this step we need to continue now whether your node.js is running or not how you can prove how you can identify open the command prompt in the command prompt you need to check one 
tag called node version node hyphen version now i am explaining the second approach using node js how to execute my javascript programs now see this is a node version here okay uh, now once you install this node what you can do uh, this application is running now so this is your javascript program there is an option called run command here click uh, there is an option called uh, let me verify this command palette let me open no click on the run there is an option called terminal guys there is an option called terminal just verify somewhere open view appearance debug see are you able to see guys there is an option called terminal in the view click terminal here now by default it will be open in the powershell see here in the left hand side you can able to see powershell even you can change powershell into the command prompt i am mostly interested in the command prompt choose the command prompt here see now this is your path here now easily you can install c node now app one see guys app one dot j uh, okay now you are in which directory javascript examples directory now i want to change this directory to 01 basics now see this is the tab now here node your application name app one dot js see here welcome to javascript course this is the second approach okay using node.js okay you can run your javascript programs we have another approach also using html i will be explaining you right now hope till now you guys are clear about how to execute in the browser now here in the node.js commands now how to check node.js version okay what is the command node hyphen hyphen version this is the one approach using node.js throughout my web series mostly i will be use the node.js browser is just specifically for your purpose just i'm show you uh, just i explain you to you guys okay now again now have a look here how to execute javascript in browser already we explained one one approach using directly we can execute execute in any browser just now i shown you now the second option we have called html with javascript this is another approach guys guys all the approaches i'm explaining so you no need to check again in the google all the uh, how to uh, install a node.js and how to everything i'm explaining here itself to you okay now this is about a one option now uh, here this option is completed how we can execute javascript in any browser just uh, right click on the inspect and run okay now another approach called html with javascript here see here open your visual studio code here inside a basic create one file called index.html file now this is your html file here let me write your html tags hope you should know about what is an html okay inside a let me write a head tag and here if you want let me write as a title tag now javascript tutorials just let me write it here and inside a head we have a called as a body tag here let me use a body tag now inside a body tag if you write h1 now you can say as a welcome to javascript okay tutorials uh, now if you execute this program see this is index.html how to run index.html everyone knows now see go to your browser now javascript basics now this is index.html now let me uh, right click i want to run in the google chrome so open with google chrome here see welcome to javascript tutorials just i given some name okay welcome to javascript now i want to i want to okay this app1.js i want to link to your html that is nothing but this is the option html with javascript how to link here index.html we need to write one tag okay before closing your body tag okay there is a script tag we have here you need to provide your script name here 
src here here what is your script name app1.js that's it done save now go to your browser application.js uh, your basics folder right click open google chrome yes now still it is printing your h1 message how to verify your javascript logs means right click and inspect here now there is an option called console see here guys welcome to javascript course now suppose see here now in the javascript code let me copy and let me paste it multiple times here instead of saying that here let me welcome to java express channel just save and just verify here just to refresh see welcome to java express channel just it is printing how many uh, log statements if you written that many number of times it is printing here now this session is completely about how to set up one for ide and node.js software after completion now just verify using browser how we can do that how to check the node.js version the next javascript we can run using node.js also okay by using command called uh, option like what is the command we used here node space app one dot js this is about running by using the node.js here and using html with javascript just now i shown you throughout our sessions i will be recommend i will be recommended this one guys okay the development will be a very fast if you use about the node.js here so that's all I will share you the all video links in our uh, description box. And guys, please don't forget to like and comment, guys. Okay, we'll catch up in the next session. Thank you.